Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. If you've been craving something sweet and chocolatey, you're in the right place. Today, we're diving deep into the world of chocolate cupcakes, and trust me, by the end of this video, you'll be equipped to create some of the most irresistible treats ever. So, why chocolate cupcakes? Well, there's something magical about biting into a perfectly baked, moist chocolate cupcake. It's not just about satisfying a sweet tooth, it's about experiencing a symphony of flavors and textures that come together in one bite. First things first, let's talk ingredients. Now, when it comes to baking, especially something as iconic as chocolate cupcakes, the quality of your ingredients can make or break your dessert. Start with premium chocolate. This isn't the time for shortcuts. Go for a high-quality chocolate that has a rich, deep flavor. Alongside that, quality cocoa powder is a must. It's what gives our cupcakes that intense chocolatey kick. Once you've gathered your ingredients, it's time to prep. Remember, baking is as much about preparation as it is about mixing and measuring. Make sure your ingredients are at room temperature. It helps them blend seamlessly and ensures a smoother batter. Now, into the mixing. Combine your dry ingredients first. This means your flour, cocoa powder, baking powder, and a pinch of salt. Why salt? Well, it enhances the chocolate flavor, making it pop even more. In a separate bowl, mix your wet ingredients. We're talking about butter, sugar, eggs, and a splash of vanilla extract. The vanilla isn't just a flavor enhancer, it rounds out the taste, making our cupcakes more aromatic and inviting. As you mix, you'll notice the transformation. The dry ingredients start to meld with the wet, creating a batter that's velvety and rich. And here's a little secret, the way you mix matters. Gentle folds, ensuring you don't overmix, will give you that perfect, airy texture. Once our batter is ready, it's time to get baking. Preheat your oven and line your cupcake trays. Remember, presentation matters. Those little cupcake liners not only prevent sticking but also give our treats a polished look. Now, here's a tip, fill each liner about two-thirds full. This gives our cupcakes room to rise without spilling over. Pop them in the oven, and while they bake, let's talk frosting. Ah, frosting. The crown jewel of our cupcakes. For a decadent chocolate cupcake, we need a frosting that's equally indulgent. Start with butter, soften to room temperature. Beat it until it's light and fluffy. Slowly add in your powdered sugar and cocoa powder. And here's where you can get creative. Want a darker? Richer frosting? Add more cocoa. Fancy a sweeter touch? Up the powdered sugar. It's all about finding that balance that suits your taste. Once your cupcakes are out of the oven and have cooled down, it's time for the best part, decorating. Whether you choose to pipe your frosting on or simply spread it with a knife, this is where your creativity shines.
Drizzle with chocolate sauce, sprinkle some chocolate shavings, or top with a fresh berry for a pop of color. And there you have it, your very own batch of decadent chocolate cupcakes. Perfect for birthdays, celebrations, or just a midweek treat to lift your spirits. Before we wrap up, I want to encourage you all. Baking, like any other art, is about practice and passion. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe for more delicious recipes and baking adventures. Until next time, happy baking!